Once upon a time, in a quaint village called Aloji, a group of hard-working folks toiled in the lush fields under the warm sun. Among them were two adorable babies, Kivigo, a cheerful little boy, and Kauli, a sweet baby girl, both lovingly nursed by their mothers. As the years passed, Kivigo and Kauli grew up side by side, their bond deepening into something more profound than friendship. However, fate dealt them an uneven hand as Kauli came from a prosperous family, while Kivigo's roots were firmly planted in modest soil. Eventually, Kauli was betrothed to a young man from a distant village, leaving Kivigo heartbroken but accepting of his harsh reality. One evening, mischief stirred among Kauli's friends, who decided to put Kivigo's love to the test. They challenged him to carry flamed charcoals in his hands all the way to Kauli's village. Undeterred, Kivigo embarked on this daring journey, determined to prove the depths of his affection for his beloved. As darkness veiled the landscape, Kivigo arrived at Kauli's village and called out to her. Recognising his voice, Kauli rushed to his side and sheltered him under a bamboo casket, cautious not to be seen by her husband. Morning arrived, and Kauli cunningly sent her husband off with the first group of people heading to the fields, providing her with an opportunity to reunite with Kivigo. Together, they planned to return to their native village, but a minor misadventure struck their path. Hungry, Kivigo climbed a fruit tree to gather some nourishment. However, in a series of unfortunate events, he found himself unable to descend as he broke all the branches. To Kauli's astonishment, her beloved slowly transformed into a magnificent hornbill before her eyes, instructing her to watch out for him whenever she hears stories of an extraordinary bird soaring through the skies. Heartbroken yet determined, Kauli returned to her husband's village and tried to find solace in her daily tasks. One day, as she was grinding corn, she overheard villagers talking about a rare and splendid bird seen in their midst. Stepping outside, Cowley saw the wondrous creature herself. Suddenly, a feather gracefully landed on her chest, and she clutched it tightly, cherishing this unique gift. That night, as Cowley slumbered, she found herself in a dream where she reunited with Kiviko. Anxiously, she inquired about the significance of the feather she now possessed. With affection in his voice, Kivigo reassured her that the feather should be cherished by generations to come, symbolising his eternal love for her. And so, to this very day, the tribes of Nagaland continue to honour Kivigo's undying love by adorning their traditional headgear, made of bear's fur, avabo, with the sacred feather of the hornbill, agachomihi, a symbol of enduring devotion and love passed down through the ages.